welcome back to part two. We are back here at Budok Veen. It's part two of the Cornish Quest. We're doing the nine holes of the fantastic course here at Budok Veen Hotel. We've yeah, got Nick. Yeah, we have got Nick. Hello. We have got Hi, Nick. Hello. 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 Um, he's always keeps out of the way of the camera because he's got himself set up for the next shot already. He's <laughs> yeah. that keen to get back into this. Sorry. It has to be said, we've not done well in the first video. If you've seen the first part, it wasn't the best golf from all of us. No, Budok Veen taught us a lesson, as it always does if you're not accurate. Yeah. Um, and we have to do a par three next with trees lying yeah. both sides. That's it. Mm. But we have got four holes. We're two over. If we can get back to level, that's two birdies. I think we'd be super pleased if I we think could we do. Could Get back to level after nine hours, I think it'd be good. Yeah. Get back to level. I'm looking at this 175 yards across the wind, tree, 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 <laughs> bunker. Oh, and a bunker, yeah, green. I forgot to say that, yeah. If we can get back to level. Yeah, can we carry on, gentlemen? So we're now on the sixth hole. We are. 175 yard par three. And it's a tough one because it's in a little copse of trees. I've already seen a hole so far when I've said, and it's not a tough one. Yeah. Yeah. But it does run away from you a little bit this one so it's Always. hard to get that green held let's head over to nick and hit, hit see what he can do of part two let you throw the back touch get the height to get over the trees as well no go through the trees on the left, it? The yeah that's actually a lovely shot nick that's a lovely shot that's going to run down. That's really going to run down. That's lovely. Do you know, I have to say, it wasn't a good shot, but it ends up a good shot. Look, if you didn't say that, people would have gone, that's a lovely shot, low, and <laughs> exactly what I need to do they under the tree. You don't see the height that they went on the camera. But you never have to tell people until you see the end of the bit of the, where it ends. And Neil's gone the high route, so high that's way off the camera. Just leaked it, right? Kind of leaked it a bit, didn't it? Okay, well, uh, I'll have a go. Look, as, as we all know, and as people have watched recently, I've not hardly did a fall at all. Grazes and it's showing. Why I picked you don't think. Really tough course to try this today, I don't know. But we are playing at my own course on Sunday. I have to get some shots in. Oh, yeah. Even if for practice, rubbish one. I think Nick's going to be there and there about there. Yeah, I think Nick's is going to be good. kind of shot there you can actually and in my defense you can actually trip it in from that side past those trees yeah. but we don't need to it's all right we've got, okay. we've got nicks down there and yeah it should be fine should be all right so it may have been ugly but it did get through and ended up just on the back of the green or just on the rough it's going to be such a hard hard uh, four holes to try and get shots back but we'll do our best often said that you can play you don't mean you play anywhere Sort of course you want to be a member of and learn how to be accurate. You work the bump there. Yeah, you got to go over them. Much better, much better. I'll have a go. So John's opting for the putt. Because I've only got a putter. That's You've only got a putter. Over there. <laughs> oh, great. That turned out great. Well done, Why didn't mine bobble and his didn't? Yeah, quite bizarre. <laughs> I let's, don't know, mate. Let's I finish know. this up with a uh, a nice little par. Or not. Oh, I know. My confidence is totally shattered right now, but it'll be back for Sunday. I've got good people around me. Well done. well done, well done. So, that ended up being a very good par, to be honest. So we're still two over, three to go. Yep. yep. And we we're going to play a nice par five now, I believe. Par five now, nice, let's nice get, big one. Let's carry on. So, whilst Nick sets up, we're on the par five. I'm looking the wrong way at the moment, because if you play off the whites, oh, yeah. there, and if you play off the yep. blues, even further up, there's a... Well, this is the second longest par five in uh, Off Cornwall. The 16th version of this hole. The 16th version, that's it's right, sorry. 573 yards. Yeah. And it's, it's right it's back up there. up there. So yeah. we're playing the slightly more modest, shortened version of 496. Okay. So And it gets very narrow up here, if I remember right. It does, yeah. I've just did we end up in front. someone's house once? I think, yeah, we did. Yeah. Yeah. 
do we have a sign that we've, we've been put there is there? a sign it's now going to be on the screen yeah but yeah you want to avoid left basically yeah avoid, avoid left, left at all side. costs yeah Shall we, uh... there we go now the corridor trees accuracy is key oh that swept out to the right on the other fairway i think that's the wrong right. fairway on the other. Is it an out of bounds on the right? Uh, I, I kept it away from the left. Yeah. But you asked me to. This wind is absolutely killing us right now. It is swirling badly. You'll hear it on the microphone. Well, I'll, I'll take a bloody wind noise reduction as I can, but. Is it a cracker, actually? Oh. It might be a cracker. Yeah, come down. Hopefully. Did it come down alright? Yeah, it just, it was going then the wind just pushed it off yeah. a little bit at the end. You don't need me. Thank, thank you very much oh. for not needing me because I really don't want to do that shot. That's alright. I forgot to say, if you think about how long this par 5 is, whether you play it off the hole that we're playing or off the 16th, and you can see how narrow it is, we've got, this is looking backwards again, so the trees are on the right at the moment and the, on the left, but you've also got this out of bounds as well. So if you think about it, when you come around this way, houses on the left, out of bounds on the right. Seriously, big score is going to happen on this hole. Neil, you did so well. So well, mate. It was all right. Luckily it hit a tree. Well, it did, luckily it hit a tree, absolutely, and it came straight down. So we are in play, and that's the key at the moment. Keeping a ball in play here is absolutely key. All we can do is punch it down towards that marker, really. Yeah, all you can do on this shot really is punch it down. It will go left to right. It'll go right yeah, down the hill. Sweet. Five, six. Yeah, it's a long way, isn't it? So it's a long old way down. I mean, in a moment, if we're, if we're, getting, if we're getting pars, we're happy, to be honest. Yeah. Par five, so it's still 250 to go. 256. Chase the five iron down. But try to keep it low. Well, try and punch it low. That is low. And it's ugly. A bit of topping stuff today. We well, yeah, you're a bit, a bit out of practice. Again, we're kind of another great thing about using a nine-hole course is that we are kind of getting rid of all the rough stuff, ready for an eighteen-hole course in a few days' time. I'm gonna move a bit closer. That's no disrespect to Beaudot Veen, by the way. In fact, it make you think which which club today, it's isn't it? Proving how tough it is. Almost to take another driver and just you know roll it down. I have seen you hit a fabulous. Uh, driver off the deck. Yeah, but I'm just worried about how the house yeah. is there, you know, it's not... It, it kind of scares you, this course. Mm. Probably would have preferred it to be a bit more than that. Yeah, but... no. Not enough. Not enough, guys. Okay. Oh. It's alright. Honestly, tree, tree, trees today, eh? Trees today. There's a seven wood, not a tree wood. <laughs> oh, you got me the wrong club. <laughs> well, Beaudot Veen reminds me of my old schoolmaster. Yeah. Tough and unfair. A uh, tough but fair. <laughs> yeah. And boy, I got a few of the daff in the cane in my days. <laughs> For younger p viewers and the Generation X, that's what used to happen when you went in school. I know, got, luckily, okay, I, was, I was in school just after that. Yeah, it all stopped. Not you naughty people and everything's fine. No, we just got whacked a lot. So, we're getting whacked a lot today by Beaudot Veen. Let's we'll turn this round. 136. So, it may have been a bit of an ugly shot, but we have got a decent shot in. And which which million pound house shall we put the ball on? <laughs> Only a million? No, not right here, mate. <laughs> so, this is, we're taking Neil's, obviously. Uh, so this, this one is a bit of a dip down, but it's also got a green that goes up at the back. So you can kind of recover if you hit it slightly hard, but if you hit it too hard, it goes over the back and we're in big trouble. 136. One, two, six. Oh, come on, come on, Ray. Come around a little bit. Oh, that was a nice kick. What a lovely bounce. Oh, Neil. Oh, what a kick that was. Sometimes, sometimes you get a lovely little bounce. That was the a best, lovely little bounce. That's the best rubbish thin I've hit all day. That the, yeah, that was the best. That was a lovely little sh dink down there, honestly. I'm almost embarrassed to try and get it closer than that. Yeah. Was that a little nine iron dig, a little pitch of putt, no? Okay. Yeah, sort of been pitching wedge. Well, that looked pretty good too, come on. That's nice too. 
stop. On the green, yeah, that's the thing. No, it didn't. No, it didn't. <laughs> well, welcome to Pew, don't think. I thought that was exactly what I wanted to hit. Yeah. Now, to the accelerator the hill and then just going over the top. Yeah, I mean, that was some acceleration. When you can spin a, a pitching wedge with spin, you know. Nick, Nick was saying about million pound ages, I think they're like multi bolted. Are they? Alright, we'll, we'll only have the two then. Yeah. I know Roger Taylor lives down the road, Robert and Queen. But Somewhere you'll do that. Or not a bit of that. No. Okay. So All right. we're gonna take Neil's. So I can assume that Neil caught that little bank step before the bunker, kicked onto the green, just past the hole. That's pretty good. It gives us a chance, lads, for a birdie. Yeah, this is one of them. One of the chances. Well this is one of the ones we have to take, isn't it? Ooh. That was pretty straight. It stayed a bit straight, didn't it? Yeah. That was very straight. I'm going to walk down here. Ooh. Well, we got the pie, lads. Wait. Whichever one you want to take, we got the pie, okay? Oh, yeah. Rubbish. Well, oh. we had a chance. We had a chance, we, we didn't take chance. the chance. And, uh, we got the pie. Yeah. We got the pie. Okay. Two to go, you never know. Exactly. I'm still wondering how my ball rolled off the back. <laughs> that is quite an upslope up there, isn't it? Oh, uh, yeah. it's, it, yeah. Okay, so I'm showing the flag right now. I'm gonna bring this back. Again, it's a it's a bit of a right to left, and that's quite a slope yeah. to be landing on, isn't there, it? There is a slope on there. 261 yard par four. Okay. It's called John's Joy, so. Yeah, well. I've never had any joy so far. No. We've got two holes left. Okay. Come on, let's get a birdie. Yeah. I, I will say, I think we we mentioned to each other, we've been driving around, that we probably never played well at the Robin. It's just I beaten us every single time. We've had a really time. good game, have we? But, but we keep wanting to come back. I know. It's, it's, it. yeah, you can't beat it. Best challenge. Best of. challenge around. Can't beat it. That's a lovely shot. Don't worry that it suits a little bit right. So it's better to be right and bouncing down left in some dodgy area. Right. Stops. That'll be okay. Stop all the trees at least. Oh, oh that's going right. right. So, so far, Nick's in play. Um, if anyone's got a ball, have a go. Oh, he's Didn't hit a good one. Nick's is all right. It's in play. It's got a shot to the green. Let's see if John can do now. We're all up there. Well, but it's a good decent shot for me. Okay, we're going to take a look. We're all that way. Yeah, that'll be all right. We'll have a look. Only taking me eight holes, but a eight drive of some kind. So, what was the uh, distance? Eighty-nine. 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 Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I love Pretty that. Pretty good. Bag, no? um, obviously, we didn't find Neil's. Couldn't find mine actually. But we're having trouble finding an orange ball, even though mine looked pretty good. So uh, we're going to take Nick's. We're just saying, what do, what do people feel about different colour golf balls? Because I must admit, I'm not... I usually like yellow ones, but at the moment at West Cornwall, there's too many little yellow flowers or whatever you want to call them around there. Yeah. So, or, well, buttercups, that kind of thing. Yeah. So I'm playing with white here, but uh, flowers. Flowers, that's the one, yeah. So we've got a little, little kind of chippered onto the green. And oh, no, a great little hole. You're worried about going long, aren't you? And well. Yeah, or if you go right, it's good because you'll kind of cascade down well, onto the green. Right over that bunker, but we'll see. Might be a bit big. Oh no, no. Um, you know, you said you were worried about getting it back. Right. Yeah. Left on the green, stay, stay, please stay. Oh, I don't think it's just stayed right on the very right edge. On the edge. Well, we'll find out. Um, I'll have a go. I better find the ball, lad. Yeah, I'll... sorry, right. Oh, right. Right. 
Right run in. Keep off the left hand side. Yeah. We're going to climb yours, Neil, but we're not going to get a, yeah. we're not going to get a bird here, are we? So mine didn't make it. Nick's going to pick mine up. Nick's on over the back. Neil's is just on that very edge. It's going to be a cracking shot to try and get that in for a birdie. But hey, we'll have a go. So super long putt off the edge of the grass or a chip off the edge of the grass. Probably a couple of feet of grass to get to the green. What a location though, what a location. Our dog's not doing justice today. Nice and steady. It's very good Nick. Not bad that's, at all. That's far. Not bad at all. Yeah. It's a par, it's not a drop shot. No, and I suppose you could say a little bit disappointing, but hey, we've said it's a ship. We, we, we could probably do going with the whole nine again and trying to catch them all back up. Yeah, but uh, we are, that's why I went long. We are playing as a nine hole today. Still, teaching us those lessons, certainly is. Last hole, best hole, what a great hole this is. Best, one of the best par threes I know. So I'm showing you this hole from the 18th, which is actually the better way of doing it, I think. But we're doing the par three from just down here, that's the ninth, going to that green over there, with that valley, beautiful valley. You can imagine if the sun was out, people would be on those sun lounges at the back there. Swoon pull on the left hand side, and you're watching us trying to hit that ball onto the green. All right, John, you've okay, probably done yeah. your little bit of spiel. Um, so mine is 124 yard par three. It is. I've not played off this side of the tees yet, so uh, it'll be interesting to see what it's like. Yeah, there's various tee positions for this one, and this is a bit different, isn't it? Yeah. Still got the serious valley yeah. and a plateau green. Uh, go short, don't go long. All right, so get, guessing the distance here, or even just getting it right, is, well, is quite, it's hard to do. Kind of downwind, I think, so you've got to take a bit off it. Yeah, the wind does swirl on this hole. One, two, six. One, two, six. Not enough. Oh, I didn't see. Normally they're not enough. And they're not Long enough. Oh. oh. It tricks everyone. This yeah. hole tricks everybody. Just you know, that on the floor, Thank you. It looks a lot shorter than it is. Uh, I really just tapped that thinking it'll be alright, but it's not at all. Way short. This 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 hole tricks everyone. It does, doesn't it? Yeah, you need to play it a few hole, times to hole. really work it out. Looks good. Looks got a distance this good. time, I think. Oh, oh well done. Lovely. And a bit of well done. Stop! Stop! Well done. Stop. Well done. Stop. Stop. Well done. That's about as close as I've ever got. Okay. Look at the pace. It's a good pace to go up. You know, hopefully it'll be that'll be the three. Oh no. It's really got to hit it. Yeah. Yeah, it's really got to hit it. I think that's quite a slope up there. I was just saying to Nick, the surface here is so it's great for playing shots in. It's um Curry to sort of describe the texture of the greens, but you've got to give the calls a good whack on the uphill yeah. ones. You did really hit this. I come back, never know. Right. Tap me in, lads. Let's get a let's get a get a par. And be happy. And well be happy. Oh right, there we go. It's been a great day and a great test on a great course. Yeah, don't be fooled by it's a nine hole course. This is a tough, yeah. it's you, a challenge. You will learn a lot of things playing at Viewdot Veen. Yeah. Um, yeah. Normally you've got to play better. Some people sort of like... <laughs> they, they, you a lot, you've got to play better. <laughs> some people sort of like, don't think nine hole courses are up to much, but this oh, one no. is a true test. It's thank you very much to Viewdot Veen for allowing us to film yeah, today. Yeah, no, thank you Viewdot Veen. Been, been, a, been a bit of fun and... Uh, and a beautiful, beautiful I mean, place. look how pretty it is, you know. 
It's, it's a stunningly beautiful place. It By is, that, yeah. I didn't mean Oggy, I was talking about the no, flowers well, and the surroundings and trees behind. It's like many beautiful women I've known over my life. They're stunning, but they're deadly. <laughs> Thank you very much, everybody. See you soon.